I've made a lot more friends at Focus than I can at school uh, because of how Focus is set up more on how it's designed to allow kids to make friends. My brother Robin and he, I uh, unfortunately I grew apart from him a lot and as we got older, her, but I still loved him. Um, uh, he uh, died when he was about 17, three years ago. Hawaii. Oh, uh, but having focus around really helped me yeah, deal with uh, that yeah, because I still had a lot of friends alive with me now. Hi, I'm Sharon, Alex's mom, and we've had quite a few challenging years with Alex. His behavior was very difficult at home and at school, and it got to the point where he sat alone in a room with a one-on-one -on -one A trying to do schoolwork. And over the last two years, he's become more and more a part of the group. He is able to sit and do activities with other children, even in groups now. Um, Focus has become the place where he hangs out with his friends. He loves to come to Focus. He loves to be with the other kids at Focus, and they truly are his friends. He even participates in the wrap-up where he explains his high point and low point of the day and what he appreciates for that day. So he's really fully included in focus, in the activities of focus and with the other kids. And best of all, he loves to come here, which is, which is really an added bonus for me because he's learning and he's enjoying himself at the same time and making friends and developing relationships. So that makes me happy. Um, a lot of Alex's behaviors come directly from his sensory issues and his sensory needs not being met. And what I like to do is assume that all his behaviors are due to his autism and not due to willful misconduct or something else. I just look at the behavior and say, how is the autism causing this behavior? And I try to deal with it. And in that way, I don't lose my temper, I don't lose my patience, because I understand that Alex can't help what he's doing and that he needs me to help him figure out what he needs at that moment. It just makes life easier for me and for my family if I always assume that the behaviors are a result of his autism, that there's something in the environment, something around him that he just can't handle at that point. So I spend a lot of time manipulating the environment around him so that it's more comfortable for him and that avoids a lot of the behaviors that we don't want to see, that we don't want to have to deal with. And using milieu therapy at Focus, Alex can come right in and practice the things he's working on. He can have a safe environment where he can practice the, the different behaviors and the different things he's learning. And if it doesn't work, they'll help him work through the situation and how could he have done it differently and what can he do next time to make that work for him. So he has plenty of time to practice and redo and evaluate how he's done and try it again. So it gives him a lot of opportunities to actually be successful and to, to make progress. Hello, my name is Alex, age 13, and basically come to focus, just meet some Great people who love to hang out, like, and do lots of cool th things with me. Focus has helped me by hey, helping people understand my autism more and help me work better on it. Because I bet you can think of a lot out of. I'll let you can think of all the things that I've done for you, or at least all of the things that I'm going to do for you. What are you going to do for me? Anything that will make you proud. I'm Sue. I'm Billy's mom, and um, we're fairly new to the, the program here at Focus. And um, before Billy started coming to Focus, uh, he was very withdrawn and had a lot of depression issues from the troubles he was having at school and in other areas in his life. And um, the 
program here at Focus just really helped him to um, to learn how to handle and cope with his his uh, disability a little bit better. And we started noticing improvements within a very short period of time after he started coming. And um, I mean, even extended family noticed changes in him within like the first month or so. And um, it's the the program here is. Um, is structured in such a way that it's easier for these kids to generalize their skills because it's already a natural um, uh, social environment. So they practice right within the context that so they don't have to try to translate it to to a different um, type of a setting. It's um, it's it's like a natural everyday life situation here at the here at Focus. So. Um, He's, I, I see a lot of the things that they do here at Focus carried over into general life situations that we have at home with, with family members. And um, it's, the program has just been really great. To coming to Focus, Billy um, had a lot of self-control issues and um, through the um, staff here at Focus working with him, he's really, um, improved on being able to um, handle himself when he hits a frustrating moment or something that kind of sets him off. And his behavior is much more appropriate. Um, we've also um, learned how to communicate better with each other um, through the, the different things that, that um, Focus has taught both of us about um, how these guys tick differently, so you got to approach them a little bit differently as a parent than you would your um, typical kid. And understanding that makes makes communication healthier. <laughs> Hi, my name is Billy, and I'm 11 years old. I had trouble in. I mean, the reason why I came to focus is I had trouble in school because they gave me hard work and. The teachers didn't understand why I was confused like this. When I'm confused, I get, I, I'm trying to think a little more, but I still don't get it. I get frustrated when I'm confused because I keep on thinking so hard. The first time I came to focus, I was sad and confused, and now I'm. When I come to focus, I'm happy and. Joyful. Hi, my name is Heidi, and I'm the mother of a Focus alumnus. CJ came here, in, here when he was in junior high. He was around 12 years old. At four or five years old, he was diagnosed with Asperger's syndrome, and he was put directly into kindergarten because he was so intelligent. They said, well, his social skills will just catch up with him. And of course, they didn't. Focus allows the children to be themselves, allows them to get de-stressed. And once they become de-stressed, then they are allowed to become more of individuals, to become friends to one another, to be comfortable in their own skin. CJ is now a junior in college studying accounting, and a good deal of his success has been to focus. And every week, I am astounded at the difference in all of the kids. You can see the progress that is being made, even though they don't know that they're here for that progress. You can see them interacting with one another. You see them becoming more comfortable. You see, you see them just being different people, being more verbal, more adventurous, more like themselves. And it's so much, it's, it's fun to see the kids as they progress, to see them get older, to see them get to be different. And it's, it's really heartwarming to see the personalities come out.